Hello there guys! For today's video, I'm going to show you how to change head direction using AI tool in Photoshop. And also, we will dive deeper into using Smart Portrait under Neural Filters, using Generative Fill. So let's get started! So here in our document, I prepare here a portrait image of our model. So, the first step we're going to do here is we're going to create a duplicate layer of our background layer. So going on to the Layers panel, Click on the background layer to make it active, then press Ctrl or Command plus J. Now once we already have the duplicated layer, click on that to make it active. Now we're, go now we're going to start to apply here the neural filters. So going on to the menu bar, go to filter, then choose on neural filters. Going on to the neural filters panel, you may be able to see here different filters that you may be able to use but in this case we're going to make use of a smart portrait all i have to do is to click this toggle switch to apply the effect there you go then from the settings under it so let's go to global and by the way if you find this video helpful so far please consider subscribing to help youtube algorithm show my videos to other nerds like us well moving back under the global you can see here head direction well take note of this if I'm going to drag this point moving to the right, the direction of our subject's head will also turn right. There you go. But if you want that our subject is facing to the left, well, we're just going to do the opposite of that and decrease the amount. Let's give it a try. There you go. In our case, I'm going to set this one to negative 50, all right, something like this. And then, once you're good with it, don't forget to hit OK. All right, so once I did that, you will notice here that there's line that we have to fix on. So the way to fix that is we're going to make use of generative fill. Now, first, you will notice here that our image is selected. So press Ctrl plus D to deselect. There you go. No more selection. And now let's go to the toolbar and let's get on the lasso tool. Or you can just press L for the shortcut key. All right. Now, to fix this area, all I have to do is to start drawing a selection around the area that we're going to fix on. Just like this. Then, go to the contextual taskbar and click on generate fill. I won't add any prompt to it. Just click generate instantly. Now, once it's done generating, Photoshop already provided us different variation choices. All right. So let's go to the properties panel and check on the others. Here's the second one. Here's the third one. All right. So actually, all of these are all perfect match. Okay. So I'll just go with the second one. All right. There you go. Now it creates that generative fill layer. And we're good with this. So let me show you the before and after. This one is the before. And this one is the after. And that is how to change head direction using AI tool in Photoshop. 